Hi, this is Overdrive. In today's video I will be showing you the original brochure of the Porsche Carrera GT. It is however not a usual brochure, if you can say that at all. This one was issued in September 2000, just before the prototype was showcased at Paris Motor Show. So today I will try to show you some differences between the prototype and the production model, which came out in 2003. Let's start from the side. We can see slightly different front brake caliper location, different center lock color and strangely lower front. You can add to that mirrors, door handles and even aluminum fuel cap and different center pillar. Porsche notes that Carrera GT had to be a road car, as light and as powerful as possible. By designing it as a race car, equipping with high-tech and high-performance parts, Porsche wanted to give an impression on how the future sports car could look like. On the back you can notice some lights being added, like stop, reverse and fog lamp. In the front, also the front lights are slightly different and now include headlight washers, license plate is located differently and bottom lamps are missing. By the way, this gentleman on the picture looks exactly like German race driver Walter Roll. 5.5 liter naturally aspirated V10 engine which was originally designed for the use on the track for the production model was increased to 5.7 liters while the power and performance increased even further. The interior looks largely different. In this picture I took at the Porsche Museum you can notice that the center console is different along with the steering wheel which resembles more the next generation of Porsches namely 997-987. Yet the most interesting part is the dashboard, which in the prototype comprised a large LCD panel, while the production model shared the analog gauges with the 911. Carrera GT came as standard with 6-speed manual gearbox and ceramic brakes. It could reach a speed of above 200 miles per hour. I found it really funny reading along um, this brochure that although all this race technology, yet the Carrera GT documents its credentials as a car for everyday use. Yes, of course. Thanks for watching and maybe see you in the next video.